Welcome to the Southwest School Compact. The purpose of the School Compact is to create a partnership between the students, staff, and parents that reflects a shared responsibility for student learning. Each member of the team plays an important role and must work together to help your child achieve academic success. School staff responsibilities, academics. The teacher will explain academic expectations, provide effective teaching strategies, and maintain current student data. Okay, today we're going to revisit what we did on Friday, and we're going to be finding an equivalent fraction by using division and drawing an area model. So do you remember doing that on Friday? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Today, though, we're going to step it up a notch because remember on Friday we were using our numerator to find how many groups we drew in our area model? Yeah. Do yeah. you remember that? Yeah. So we had a, a fraction that looked kind of like this. We had like three six. And then we drew our area model and we were circling groups of three because that was our numerator, right? Yeah. Well, today it's going to be a little bit more difficult. We're going to have a fraction that looks like this, ten. 12. So will we be able to draw groups of 10? No. Are we going to be able to divide 10 into 12? No, no. no we're not going to be able to do that. So we're going to have to look at the area model that we draw and find out what number, what, how many groups in each group are we going to be able to circle that we're going to divide into the 10 and into the 12. And that's going to tell us what number goes into both. So by the end of today, you're going to be able to Find an equivalent fraction using division and using the area model to get your equivalent fraction. And that equivalent fraction is also going to be in its lowest form. Okay? okay. You ready? Yep. yep. We can yes. do it, right? Yes. Yeah. yes. All right, let's go. Studying. The teacher will model and teach organizational and study skills and teach students to self-monitor. All right. So on Monday, today, you guys are going to write down that you need to study your vocabulary for Unit 4. So study. It's going to be Unit 4, Week 2 words. You can use Quizlet to practice your vocabulary words, and you can use your uh, vocabulary definition cards. You're also going to be studying your Greek and Latin. What are my Greek and Latin words? Prefaxes? Mm -hmm. Same thing you guys can use your Quizlet to study or your word sort that went home last week. You should also be studying your spelling words. Again, uh, you can go to Spelling City to study those words or use your list that you've been given. Yes? Um, isn't our test the same exact day as our reading test? Yes, they are both on Wednesday, so you should be studying for Wednesday. And uh, is, isn't there electronic homework? Yes. Yes, there is electronic homework. So let's write that also. Electronic homework. It's Scootpad. ELA. It is due on Friday. We have our West State, States and Capitals, so you should be studying your State and Capitals for the West. When is your test on that? Next week. So make sure you're studying using your study guides. You guys made up your study guides last week. Respect and Responsibility. The teacher will implement PBIS, which is the Positive Behavioral Intervention and Supports. The teacher will also provide a safe learning environment and model acceptance and respect of diversity. All right, so today we're going to do our wrap-up. And does anybody know why we've earned these wrap-ups? What's one reason why we might get a wrap-up, Miss um, Lily? We might have helped our friends out. Okay, so by being kind, what are other things we get them for? Think of PBIS. What's one of the reasons we might get them? So what do you be in then if you're turning in your homework? Responsible, can you say responsible? Responsible. Okay, what's another reason we might get these? Thinking about our PBIS, our three things. Um, Mr. Miss, Mr. Christopher? Um, he advises Okay, so what's our other word for that? Responsible and? Respectful. 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 Okay, so we earn them for respect. And then what's one other reason? One, two, three. Say. Say. One, two, three. Say. All right, can I get a drum roll? All right, so let's see. When we will three boys and three girls that have earned the bonuses. 
No, Miss Maggie. Oh. We'll grab a coupon and a pretzel. Maddie Berry. Yes. Coupon and a pretzel. Being respectful, responsible, and safe. Uh, Miss Rosebud. Communication. The teacher will share classroom and building information. The teacher will also respond to the parents' concerns in a timely manner and share information about student progress. It's time for us to list our homework. So let's check the Monday note, which is online on the Weebly site. I see Wednesday we have a math quiz on adding and subtracting fractions with like and unlike denominators. So we want to be sure we list that on our homework. So on our homework, let's list math worksheet page 80 due Wednesday. Math Quiz Wednesday, which is adding and subtracting fractions. Science, we have the Science Anticipation Guide due Thursday. And in reading, we have the Wordly Wise Lesson 7 Packet due Friday. Be sure you're reading your Accelerated Reader book, your AR book. Again, this is posted online each night, so you can always refer back to the Monday note or the homework listed on the weekly site.